question. So today I'm going to share with you The Anti-Racist Baby by Ibram X. Kendi and illustrations by Ashley Lukashevsky. And I'm really excited to share this with you. And I hope that this is helpful for you and your families. Um, so sit back, relax, and enjoy The Anti-Racist Baby by Ibram X. Kendi. Anti-racist baby is bred, not born. Anti-racist baby is raised to make society transform. Babies are taught to be racist or anti-racist. There's no neutrality. Take these nine steps to make equality a reality. One, open your eyes to all skin colors. Anti-racist baby learns all the colors, not because race is true. If you claim to be colorblind, you deny what's right in front of you. So Kendi wants us to teach our kids to identify race because there's nothing wrong with it. Number two, use your words to talk about race. No one will see racism if we stay silent. If we don't name racism, it won't stop being violent. Three, point of policies is the problem, not people. Some people get more while others get less because policies don't always grant equal access. Four, shout. There's nothing wrong with people. Even though all races are not treated the same, we are all human, anti-racist baby can proclaim. Number five, Celebrate our differences. Anti-racist baby doesn't see certain groups as better or worse. Anti-racist baby loves a world that's truly diverse. I like that this baby has on a shirt that says defend the sacred. Number six, knock down the stack of cultural blocks. Anti-racist baby appreciates how groups speak, dance, and create as they choose. Anti-racist baby welcomes all groups voicing their unique views. Number seven, confess when being racist. Nothing disrupts racism more than when we confess the racist ideas that we sometimes express. Again, that's that point of acknowledging. Number eight, grow to be anti-racist. Anti-racist baby is always learning, changing, and growing. Anti-racist baby stays curious about all people and isn't all-knowing. Never an expert. Number nine, believe we shall overcome racism. Anti-racist baby is filled with the power to transcend, my friend, and doesn't judge a book by its cover, but reads until the end. Look at all that hope. We shall overcome. And at the very back, there's some really helpful tips for parents and caregivers. So ask your child uh, certain things, describe things to describe to your kids, some activities and ideas, and sharing your own experience with racism, helping kids understand that policies are the problem, not people, and that we live in a society that has created those policies. And how can we continue to tear them down, and how can we individually choose to be better and make better choices? So thank you so much for sharing this book with us. I hope that it was helpful. I hope that it can help you have conversations with your kiddos. And I will also post a shortened clip of this on my YouTube. So if you want just the actual storytelling, it will be there for you as well. Thank you so much for sharing this book with us today. I appreciate all the work that you are doing. I appreciate how we continue to raise anti-racist babies. Let's continue to develop our love of reading together and let's change the world. Till next time.